Hey guys, um, this is Honey Booth, another, uh, what's it called, freaking commentary, and, uh, thank you guys for so many, uh, supporters on, uh, my new series, I've gained a couple of subscribers, like maybe four or five, uh, I'm really thankful for that, but, um, without further ado, uh, let's get to the new, uh, story, so this story happened when I was about, mm, fifth grade, fifth grade, okay, and, um, the Minara story that I said, it comes, like, really close to this, but it has a weird ending. So we're playing soccer, okay, with um, you know my friends. Okay, we're sitting out there in the uh, the court for you know school. Uh, what's it called? The playground. And the playground at school was like my old school. It was Catholic school. It was all metal and it was weird, okay. And it was full of metal uh, objects, pointy metal objects, and it was asphalt. So you guys can kind of tell what's going on. And the only game us boys would play would be. Um, dodgeball okay so we would play dodgeball and I remember one day you know we got in trouble so we had to stop playing dodgeball and um <laughs> we had to stop playing dodgeball oh dear we had to stop playing dodgeball and then uh, we went over and played soccer in the old soccer net so we asked one of the lunch ladies uh, like the um, people that sit outside you know monitor the people that are in lunch so, we asked one of them to, hey, keep bringing the, Leno, the net over so we can play soccer. And this kid's mom helped, uh, this kid named Christian, uh, his mom helped him bring the net over, okay? And then, um, so we started playing soccer in the net, and it was so fun. Um, until like, he did something that was like, I don't know what happened, honestly, like, what, why that happened. But, uh, something happened, and we... I, I purposely tripped him. Uh, I don't think it was on purpose. It might have been on purpose. Who cares? And um, he hit his knee off the sharp metal pole, and his leg was oh god, it was disgusting. Half everyone like my grade was crying, and I got a little teary eyed. I didn't really mean to do that, but it was horrible. Blood was going everywhere. Uh, they hitting the ambulance to school. His mom helped bring the net over. Ran down from the cafeteria because she was on shooting up there. And, um, she was like, oh my god, and then you could see his bone, like, literally his bone through his leg, and, um, yeah, it was probably one of the scariest things I've ever seen in my life, the most disgusting, like, I've seen in my actual lifetime, like, not on the internet, like, in person, and, you know, it was horrible, uh, this kid blamed himself, I don't know why, he just was like, guys, it was me, Okay, I don't know why he would do that, but I was only, I really had no problem with that. But, um, yeah, and he went to New York, right, L literally maybe two months after that, he left and went to New York, and I've never seen him again. But he did start following me on, like, social media, which is kind of weird. Um, I don't know why he just searched my name up or something, but, yeah, it's kind of weird. But hope you guys enjoyed this video, uh, make sure to leave a thumbs up if you guys want to hear more, um, more stories and uh, sorry guys for uh, you know me being sick uh, I kept having like burps and stuff but uh here's um PC gameplay of Grand Theft Auto uh, I use like my new controller that helps me like on PC like X and Y it's like a PlayStation but it's super cool but um yeah guys so uh have a good day and I leave a like bye guys